All right, Brendan, it's been a long uh, off season, obviously a tough fall with uh, the first part of your schedule being canceled, but now finally a chance to play some games. What's kind of the mindset on the team this week as you get ready for Saturday? Uh, trying to execute and practice on defense and offense, get another plays, and uh, hopefully go out there and get a win on Saturday. I'll talk a little bit what it was like, uh, you know, just practice after practice, uh, no games in sight. What did you guys kind of work on and how did you stay focused? Uh, you just had to work on mental toughness and just being strong defensively as well, uh, keeping our bodies right. I mean, no gains, but still, they made the coaches made it competitive and practiced enough for us still. So, um, treated like any regular season for the most part, practice wise. So, I mean, we're just excited to finally go out and play. Uh, talk about uh, just personally what, what your goals are kind of for the spring. You got two seasons under your belt in the program now. What are you uh, hoping to achieve this spring? Uh, just get better in each and every day, help our team get better, and uh, you know, hopefully come out uh, with these four games, four wins. So, I mean, that's all I can really ask. And just keep getting better each day. Uh, talk a little bit about the team and dynamic this year, particularly the newcomers, how they've done uh, fitting in and what it's been like to be in a leadership role. Uh, I think for the most part, everyone's starting to fit in a little bit. Um, obviously, at the beginning, you always have like growing pains, especially with new young team like we had this year. But I think everyone's like kind of buying into what we're trying to do here defensively. And I think we're starting to finally get the hang of it offensively, so it'll be interesting to see. Uh, how do you think a year like this can actually maybe help you as you, you prepare for uh, the GNAC season looking forward to next year? Uh, okay, hopefully these games will get a couple guys' feet wet, so necessarily, um, basically it'll be like our preseason, basically like what we normally do, we think it'll all taste that now, and we'll get a little taste of that before we really get into GNAC play next year. Well, it's, yeah, it, it feels like the first game. Uh, the problem is it's, it's February, so that's where the you know the weirdness comes in. But um, we need, we need to play a few, you know, to, uh, just to break things up more than anything. Uh, we did have a long break at Thanksgiving, but uh, you know we got about a dozen practices under our belt, so need to kind of see them when the lights turned on. And so it'll be good for us to kind of evaluate where we're at. We have been going together a long time since school started off and on, but uh, yeah, strange times. But excited to kind of hopefully make this month go by fast with a few games. Yeah, with Brendan now third year in the program. Um, you know, Sam Elliott's been around three years. Krishan Dixon who played a lot, obviously, and started as a freshman. Uh, Clarence Daniels also got some valuable time as a freshman. Uh, those are the type of guys, you know, we'll lean on. Uh, they've been been here with us. And then, you know, we have a couple transfers. Brent Finn, uh, transfer from, from MSU from Big Timber, and uh, Carrington Wiggins, a junior college transfer in the backcourt. And, and inside, Jimmy Brown is a transfer inside, too. A lot of them just haven't played games for a long time. Like, you know, a couple guys have had a year off, so they've really had you know, a long time off uh, since they've played. So just anxious to get, get a few games under our belt. But definitely, uh, Brendan, you know, highlights the group with his experience, uh, along with Krishan, I would say. In a normal year, this would be kind of the, the stretch time of Great Northwest Athletic Conference play. You'd be sort of positioning for uh, room in the standings, a couple GNAC games a week. So instead of that, uh, what do you kind of hope to see out of these players as a coach with that not being on the table? Well, I, I think, again, it's a, it's a start of the season stuff, you know, the, the slippage, uh, you know, we, obviously we, we aren't, you know, in February form because um, we haven't played any games, but uh, how we compete, um, you know, how, how we'll be defensively, uh, we're young, you know, right now with, with just one senior on the roster at this time. Um, and then offensively, I think you always want to see how they mesh together and play together. Uh, that type of thing. So yeah, a lot of new faces, pretty young, uh, and uh, yeah, kind of see where we're at after after we play.